start with an image of some old red building. Also to add the images plane, you will need to turn on that add-on. Rotate the image plane 90 degrees. Add loop cut to create new face and delete the unnecessary parts. Select everything and extrude to make a box. To fix this transparent issue, go to material properties and uncheck show back face. Now add a camera to the scene. And in the view sidebar, check camera to view. Orbit the viewport to find a good angle. Then uncheck the camera to view. To create multiple floors, shift plus D to duplicate. Again add loop cut to create a face around the bottom and delete the loop. Then select both buildings and control J to join. Now split the viewport and switch to top view in the second. Duplicate the buildings and scatter them around. Also keeping an eye in the camera view. For the background, simply add a plane, rotate it 90 degrees and scale that up. Now change the second editor to shader editor. Select the building and add a hue saturation node. Then drop it between. Simply changing the hue will change the color. But before that make sure you click the number up top. So other buildings don't copy it. I won't touch the second building. I'll change the third one to greenish. And same to the last one. Now let's collapse the shader editor and then copy some of the buildings and move them across. Rotate. For lighting, go to World Properties and under Color, select Sky Texture. Before we change anything here, change the render engine to Cycles first. Device to GPU for faster results. Then under Color Management, view to Standard and look to High Contrast. Then in the Sky Properties, I will only change the elevation and then increase the air and dust values. Spend more time to create better results. See you in the next video.